Happening today, a chance for the Seminole Heights community to come together and get into the holiday spirit. Amanda Shavari joins us now live from Seminole Heights, and we're just hours away from that Light the Heights event there, Amanda. Yeah, Evan, and it is so exciting. People who come to the community today are going to be able to visit about 60 different businesses. We're talking about little boutiques, restaurant bars, the whole nine yards will be included in this first annual Light the Heights event. And to talk to me about this are the organizers. We have these three lovely ladies in their matching t-shirts right here. <laughs> Courtney in the center, she's been nominated to talk to us. So Courtney, this kind of all started as a way to, to honor the police department and to say thank you, but it's really grown since then. Yeah, it started as a way to help them out. And then now that the shooters been caught we shifted our focus towards helping the businesses I mean they're why people move to Seminole Heights so we knew they were struggling and we wanted to do something to encourage people from outside of the area to come back and support all the great restaurants and bars and talk to me about what you've been doing in that time since you originally started to plan this to today you've been able to actually help decorate homes throughout this community and we're talking about a lot of homes in this community yeah at this point I think we've decorated almost 60 homes um, it's been great we've been able to help people that are physically unable or cannot afford Christmas lights or decorations and and it's just been wonderful to see what a big difference it makes for some people just to bring holiday cheer to them. And real quickly, it sounds like a silly question, but why is it so important to have the holiday spirit to bring everyone back together? I mean, it just kind of, we were in kind of a lull or a lump of... Uh, <laughs> it was a hard time. Yeah, it was a hard time for a little while. And so it's been great to have the neighborhood come together, all the volunteers that have worked so hard. And now today is kind of our way to celebrate all of our hard work and to show off all of our great businesses. Courtney, ladies, thank you very thank much. You. you guys, this event is going to be going all day. There's even a free trolley making about 19 stops to the various businesses that are involved in this. We'll have all the information about these stops, how you can check out this amazing event at WFLA.com. But Evan, I'm going to send it back to you and hang out with with all the festive people out here. Yeah, I love those smiles in Seminole Heights right now. Thanks so much, Amanda Shavari.